Supreme Court's most senior judges urged to stand down from crucial Brexit case over his wife's pro-Remain tweets declaring EU referendum was mad and bad. The Supreme Court's most senior judge was urged to stand down from a hearing on Britain's EU exit yesterday as it emerged his wife had posted anti-Brexit messages online. Pro-Brexit MPs accused Lord Newberger, President of England's highest court, of being compromised by his wife's tweets. Lady Newberger had denounced the EU referendum as mad and bad dash and dismissed to keep and Brexit as just a protest vote. Lord Newberger is one of ten Supreme Court justices to decide on whether the government can trigger Article 50, the mechanism for leaving the EU dash without parliamentary approval. His wife, 69, made the posts under her maiden name Angela Holdsworth. The High Court had ruled that Parliament must have a vote, in a move critics said put Britain on course for a full-blown constitutional crisis. The government is appealing the decision at the Supreme Court. In June, Lady Newberger appeared to preempt the issue that her husband and his colleagues must decide, by repeating a Remain campaign group's message, the Daily Telegraph reported. It said, it seems unlikely that a PM could trigger Article 50 without Parliament's approval. In May, a month before the referendum, Lady Newberger wrote, You keep just the protest vote as, I fear, is Brexit for many. And the week before the vote, in June, she said, referendum mad and bad. Lady Newberger, a former BBC producer, also criticized the BBC over its rules on impartiality just days before the historic vote. She tweeted, need for balance can give weight and credibility to the unreliable. Three days after the poll she complained that too many voters had been misled into thinking various grievances would be resolved by leaving. They won't be. She also attacked the Prime Minister, branding Theresa May wrong, and, on November 1st, accused her of jeopardizing higher education by our new nasty reputation and obstinacy of PM and insisting temporary foreign students treated as immigrants. Last night Tory MP Andrew Bridget said, I think he should stand down. This is a crucially important judicial decision for our country and it must be seen to be taken impartially. Another Conservative MP, Andrew Rosindel, said, This is embarrassing for the Supreme Court. His wife's views are injudicious and clearly his position is compromised. But the senior source told the newspaper the judge was absolutely confident there had been no breach in this case. The source added, This case is about a point of law and Lady Newberger's views are nothing to do with it. A Supreme Court spokesman said, Justices' spouses are fully entitled to express personal opinions, including on issues of the day. Lady Newberger's passing comments on Twitter have absolutely no bearing on Lord Newberger's ability to determine the legal questions in this case impartially, according to the law of the land. The Supreme Court's Judicial Code of Conduct states, 